Ghana is expecting some 5,000 elite athletes, 3,000 experienced officials and thousands of fans in the country for the 2023 Africa Games. And this has increased the need for assurances that the available facilities would be ready. The $154 million state-of-the-art Bortiman Sports Complex has been earmarked to host seven different sporting disciplines when the Games commence. With the country already boasting of two Olympic standard swimming pools at the Ligon Stadium and the Trust Sports Emporium, it is a newly constructed aquatic center at the Bortiman Sports Complex that will host the swimming events at the Games. The 1,000-seater swimming center will be home for the main swimming competition as well as the swimming leg for the triathlon. The facility, also equipped with a modern-day eight-lane warmer pool, boasts of all the necessary equipment to host a world-class swimming competition. The five-court tennis complex will host both the male and female tennis. The complex consists of four outdoor courts and a thousand-seater enclosed center court which roofs the spectators. The center court will host the finals of the tennis events. The multi-purpose dome, which is equipped to host an array of sports from basketball to volleyball to futsal, will be the home of both the handball and table tennis at the Games. The semi-enclosed 500-seater edifice is set to accommodate over 15 tables for the table tennis competition, including warm-up tables for the athletes when the Games. It's a very comfortable and well-equipped VIP area, has its own bathroom, has a fantastic uh, lighting and a very good and comfortable seating also. You can see Team Ghana is here practicing and gearing up for um, when they take on their opposition at the 2023 Africa Games. They are just basically testing out the facility and they are pretty satisfied with what they are seeing and we are also pretty satisfied because this is clearly state of the art and uh, the organizers and uh, the guys in charge of the facility have told us that they are very prepared and very ready to host the rest of Africa at the 2023 Africa Games. President of the Ghana Badminton Federation, Ivan Siaboa, says he's highly impressed with the standard of the facility. Very, very, very great. Um, coming from all the depth that has been across the country, it's an infrastructure that has never been seen. It's very unprecedented. And we are very grateful to the Ministry of Youth and Sport and other stakeholders for putting this facility in place. If you look at the facility, it's a thousand seater capacity, indoor multi-purpose. It will allow us as a national federation to be able to host international tournaments, to be able to give our players better access to facilities. It will be able to guide our technical enhancement through our strategic plan. So this infrastructure has come as a very good time and starting it with the African Games can never be the best of what we had anticipated. Ivan Siaboa also talks us through the setup plan for the Games with regards to badminton. Ghanaians and, and uh, the general residence public would see a very, very enhanced competition court. In total, we are going to have eight courts uh, filling the whole of this quadrangle. And these eight courts means that you are going to see a total of eight matches potentially ongoing concurrently. This offers the viewership and the public like the gallery of seeing a first class badminton tournament. Because as you remember, uh, this will be the first Olympic qualifier in the multi-purpose hall. So you have high level athletes who are extremely high elite professionals who are coming to participate in this particular African Games. And if you look at it, you're going to have a division where you have the main competition hall, you have the practice hall behind it, and then the warm-up court will also swing on the left side of the arena. So it's all filled and it will be capacity filled. So we will entreat each and everyone to come and watch uh, Africa's Best uh, during this African game, starting on the 3rd of March and ending on the 10th of March. It's been a long time coming, but the Bortiman Sports Complex is ready to host the rest of Africa at the 2023 Africa Games. In all, seven sporting disciplines will be hosted here, beginning with badminton, which will start on the 3rd of March. Uh, that's just next month. The competition handlers and the guys in charge of the facility have opened it up for low-profile preparatory competitions as well as training sessions just to make sure that their I's are dotted and their T's are crossed as ahead of the start of the competition. Reporting from the Baltimore Sports Complex for Joy Sports, my name is Daniel Kranting.